do subscribe to ekeda channel and press bell icon to get updates about latest engineering hsc and iit je main and advanced videos hello students today we are studying chapter excretion and osmoregulation and in that we are studying topic hemodialysis now hemodialysis is a process that one does when their kidneys have failed today we will be studying about this process hemodialysis is a process that one does whenever the kidney fails and hemodialysis machine a artificial kidney machine or you can say it works on the same principle as your kidney works yes it does ultra filtration glomerular filtration but outside your body and your blood has to be given to through those machine and this is done on weekly basis or leaving a gap of 4 5 days depending upon the severity of the patient and how their kidney has been damaged hemodialysis now hemodialysis is a procedure that's used whenever somebody's kidney is not functioning properly or it has eventually failed now kidney failure is treated by this hemodialysis machine it's a machine which can be eventually said as artificial kidney that works on the same principle as your real kidney works yes it does the process of ultra filtration glomerular filtration selective absorption all of them now the blood of the patient is basically pumped out of the body and it is filtered to remove the waste products through this machine it removes waste products from your blood the waste products may include urea sodium potassium that's basically present in excess in your blood and that is not required by your blood or your cells and that has to be eventually removed out also hemodialysis machine uh, basically takes 6 to 8 hours to purely filter your blood and it's basically done in patients for on a minimum for thrice a week or twice a week So students this was hemodialysis i hope you all are very clear about this concept thank you